funny enough, weather in game, same outside. Go figure. Hey guys, welcome back to Star Fox Adventures with me, Panaka K. Um, how you doing? <laughs> uh, this is the second time I've had to read toward commentary because my first commentary didn't come out at all. I don't know why. It sucks. I hate it. Hate it so much. Anyway, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the clip that you are watching now. I was at a party, and I decided that I wanted to drink. So they had fruit punch. With vodka in it. So, I drank two glasses through a straw and became intoxicated. So, I decided it was a perfectly good idea to record Star Fox. And about maybe eight minutes of me getting lost later after this clip. So I cut that out in editing and I put in, um, I waited a little while, I got sober, I, <laughs> I waited until <laughs> I waited until I got sober to record again. And then I did the puzzle just fine. So this is of course after um, this all happened. So I'm gonna cut to my good attempt play right now. Ow. I call that my good attempt. Anyway, so this is hours later when I finally sobered up. I finally I was in a good place by the way. I, I was with friends. I was in a you know in my dorm, everything was fine. I just thought it was the perfect idea to just start recording while intoxicated. Um, yeah, that's basically the plan of what happened. Um, but now, you know, this puzzle here, it actually can be a little difficult. You need your lantern and you need to carry this timed fuel barrel all the way to the other side of this completely pitch black room. So you'll need the lantern to light your way in order to get through this place. Now, while in here, I was extraordinarily lost. Like, super lost. Like, so lost it wasn't even funny. And I still can't do this puzzle while well, even sober. But um, anyway, I got lost for about eight minutes, and um, I was like, okay, that was that's not a good idea. So I, I I cleaned myself up, and I just, you know, went to sleep, and then finally was able to do this puzzle perfectly on the second attempt when I was all better. So that's the story about this clip. I'm going to put the... <laughs> my wanderings around this place in a little separate video so you guys can laugh at me. So don't worry about that. So we are now in Krizoa Palace and our mission is to release the spirit and not die. Which will probably not happen because I suck at video games. So I'm already on fire. I'm already on fire. I need to heal, but that's a firefly, so that's not gonna happen. Oh boy. This is gonna be great! Great. Great gameplay. So, we have to take this across to uh, blow that up, but of course I die. But apparently we have plenty of, of the. Uh, oh, I can never pronounce this word. Bafamdad. 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 A foobada hoobada 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 in order to heal us. So we're fine. And it's great. Everything's fantastic. I s yeah. So we did that. Um. And of course there's health in there, but that. Oh! Oh god! So, um. If you remember this puzzle, I think we did this in the Volcano Force Point where you had to shoot a, uh, uh, energy blast through the, um, through the colored flame. Uh, I think we did that in Force Point. 
and then that turns off the shield, and then you can just barrage this thing with a million. Until it blows up. Now, over there is a switch. In order to step on that switch, well, I mean, in order to step on that switch, you walk over into it and step on it, and it opens the door. However, it's a pressure switch, so it closes the door as soon as you step off. So we need to find something to put on it. And what are the thing that we're gonna put on it than a dangerous f fuel barrel? F -f 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 fuel barrel, which we need to get through some fire. Perfect scent, right? Right? So we need to get one over there. And apparently I can't see fire that's straight in front of my face. So that's impossible. Go, go, go. Oh, there we go. Oh, I'm so pro at this game, even though I'm not. So we need to put this down to put push down the switch. And this looks like one of the same rooms that Crystal was in when she got her first Crusoe Spirit. Ugh. My my throat. Oh, excuse me. I am sorry about that. So we defeat the Sharp Claws, and this was either the first shrine or something, but now we can't leave. So the only way to go is forward. Let's just go. And we go through this familiar looking hallway and <gasps> where she released the spirits gone. Oh no. So this was the place that had the uh, the original crystal. Ooh! These uh, wind lifts were here. And we have to figure out where to release our spirit. Um, be careful on these wind lifts because they can be a little finicky. And um, if you don't do things perfectly, then uh, you'll die. So yeah. Um, we have to figure out where to release our spirit. We can't release it there because we can't get into that room, but we will be able to get into that room soon. And of course, there are more sharp claw, so we have to kick their ass. I mean, why would we kick their ass? They're the bad guys. There's a room we can go into. But is it where we can release our spirit? Up, uh, no. Nope. It is apparently inaccessible. Um, the wind lift isn't on, and we can't get to the other side via the wall, so... Um, this place just isn't accessible to us, so... This isn't where we release the spirit! Ugh, I am... I'm sorry. I've been editing all day. <laughs> I just uploaded, um... Another video today, and I've been editing basically all day so it, it's been very tiring um my dog is just looking at me she's adorable right now so might as well go up hopefully we can but you know uh oh Ooh. it's a miracle that fox doesn't like break every bone in his body the man eats his broccoli. Or smaller mammals. Either one. Anyway, so, um... <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. Oh, God damn it. I'm sorry. That's the reason why you don't, you know, you be, caref you be careful on the wind lifts or else you'll die. And you'll fall and it will hurt. And it hurts a lot, so be very careful when transferring to different wind lifts. See, we almost didn't make it again. So let's get up here and see what we can find. There's a wind lift right here, but it doesn't do anything. That's weird. So, we are going to go to the other side, where there is another wind lift. And see if that one will take us up. And it does! So now we're on the roof, and here comes the best scene in the entire game. I'm gonna shut up for this. Wow, she's beautiful. Whoa, the Crisola spirit. 
Big fella, good to see you doing your job and helping out. You cheeky little blighter! <laughs> now, I've been keeping this back for you, ready for when you needed it. Once again, huge grin. Slippy, we never need you. Sh shut up. Anyway, uh, um, there's something that's over here that I forgot to check out for y'all guys. Um, if you plant a bomb spore here and then explode it, um, there's a little cave. Ow. And inside are some health and two fuel cells, one which is impossible to get. Wow, okay, okay, there we go, got it. Brings us up to 26 fuel cells. Um, I think we don't need that many for our next destination. Oops, spoilers! That's okay, we're gonna be going there soon. So, you can tell that the, um, the Thorntail lady's not here right now, so she's back here with her eggs and she says I fear for the safety of my young great lady um there's a little thing with her later but um it's not for a little bit later in the game so um the warp stone gave us some uh what's it called scarabs or no he didn't give us scarabs he gave us a scarab bag so we can collect a hundred scarabs but um I'm gonna be collecting some scarabs, and you don't want to watch that because that's boring. And so I will see you guys when I am done scarab collecting a little bit. So see you then. All right, now we are at the Thorntail shop. I have collected just enough scarabs in order to get what we need here. Trust me, what we're, what we're gonna get is something that we need. So just trust me. We have to talk to this guy again, which sucks. So we're gonna go into food. Where he has all this lovely stuff. Bomb sore, fuel cells, scrub tubs for 12 scarabs. I don't know why. But um, he has all this stuff, but we don't need any of it. Because everything is readily accessible at you know, to the place. We need it to go with special goods. And there's a Cape Claw map. We're gonna buy this. You pay this much. God, your voice. Okay, I'll 
I'll send it to you. God, your voice makes me want to die. Hurry and choose something, or get out! Jeez, I hate that guy. Ugh. Um, we're also going to need um, these two things. Well, we don't really need them, but... You pay this much. It's a good idea to get these. Okay, I'll sell it to you. <laughs> anyway, this is a um, high-definition goggles, which will make um, first-person a little bit better. Slippy apparently fucked that up, too, so, you know, we had to go and buy it. Um, that's gonna be important later, but we can't get that right now because we don't have enough scarabs and it's really expensive. So, we could buy an Ocean Force Point map, a Krizoa map, or a uh, Dragon Rock map. We're gonna buy the Krizoa map. So we have a map to Krizoa Palace now, and that's fantastic. That's gonna help us in a little bit. We're gonna get one thing, and that's uh, Tricky's ball. This isn't um, needed, but I'm gonna get it anyway. No, that's too low. Oh yeah, you can haggle with this guy. Okay, I'll sell it to you. If you go too low, he won't buy it or sell it. But yeah, anyway, we're gonna get this. Um, Tricky's Ball. You can only play fetch with him in certain areas. Um, if you play with him a lot, he'll change color. I'm just gonna, you know, just tell you right there. He'll change color. He can change colors about maybe a few different times. Um, it's not really important to the game. It's just a cute little feature. But, uh, we did a little bit in this place. We, res uh, we released the Krizoa Spirit. We... Um, got back to Thorntail, and we are preparing to go into the next length of our journey. So, let's play with Tricky for a little bit. I'm gonna leave it off right here, with playing with Tricky. I'll see you guys later.